morning all. Just giving it a minute to make sure everybody's in. Okay, we are running close to time, so I'm going to just crack on and kick off. Um, welcome everybody. Uh, this is our AGM for 2022. Hard to believe we're still in this year. It's been so long. Um, we've got a great lineup. We've got next a panel on the cost of living, and then we are heading into some AGM business. And in the afternoon, we've got a panel on join a union, uh, followed by a, a more AGM business and a chat uh, for members about what we should do in the next year. So, uh, when I look back over Just Transition Greens activities, the theme of political inclusion emerged for me anyway. Um, I wouldn't say this was deliberately decided as our theme, but when uh, when it, when I saw it, I, I thought, gosh, look at the issues and the topics that we've tackled this year. And it reaffirmed my belief in how important it is to listen and consider a diverse range of views and experiences and how when they're authentically listened to and not just symbolically done. Uh, it strengthens our democracy and it strengthens what we are, uh, are living with politically as individuals. So I'm really proud to work together with fellow committee members from across the island um, to work uh, on behalf of members of many co communities and backgrounds and experiences, um, which is sometimes uh, when I look at it considered a bit unlikely as a uh, let's say if I was to put myself in a box, a British born woman from what would be classed as a unionist background, uh, working across the island with many others. Um, and that, that shows that we're unafraid to have conversations, campaign on a variety of different issues with a variety of different people. Um, we've, we've done things like uh, panel discussions and informative talks on the conflict in Palestine on the Nordic model of sex work, supported women and babies healthcare campaigns for the National Maternity Hospital, looked at the rights of disabled children, lobbied for bystander intervention, training and safety on our streets, have looked at housing issues um, and sought to develop a shared understanding of what an agriculture transition might look like by talking to farmers and others in agriculture, as well as yeah, green campaigners and environmentalists. Policy groups uh, and the committee uh, have worked tirelessly to make policy submissions on pertinent issues and uh, to lobby for more radical change that doesn't harm uh, people of this island. Um, I, I just need to finally say thank you so much to my fellow committee, um, to all that have got involved from those in the policy groups to those lobbying campaigning on the sidelines uh, and the wider body of members. Um, and to our Treasurer and Secretary for making sure that we're always right and on point. So that all said, it's now 11.02 and I'm going to hand over to Ben for uh, the first of a much more interesting than what I've just said panel discussion. Thanks.